See? You're stalking her. It's happening again. So what do you want to do? I don't know, but I'm not backing off this time. Well, no one's asking you to. So you agree that these pictures, they're, they're too much, yeah? I, I don't know what they are. <sighs> How can I help him when my first instinct is to think the worst? I was about to tell Alicia when you found me. To honor. I guess. I was going to drop him in it before I'd even given him a chance to explain. All right. That's what we do. Talk to him together as soon as he gets home. I'm in. Hey. I knew you couldn't resist having another tipple with me. Hey. How long have you been out there? I'm freezing here just looking at you. Is, um, is anybody here? No, wow, what's up with you? I, uh, I think I was, um... What? Well, L Lachlan was over and, uh... And? Like, it got wrong, you know, it got, it got really... How? How did it get wrong? I, uh... I think he just assaulted me. Alicia, did he just hit you? No, I, um... He undid my shorts and... Uh, and then he went further and... Uh, oh, my oh, my God. Oh, my God. <gasps> Did he, um... Did he rape you? Everything born, and I don't know what to do now. Okay. Robbie, what do you want to do? Okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Um, uh, right, right. We're gonna phone the police. Okay? We're gonna get help. Okay. I was sleeping, I guess. Um, I'm all like passed out from all the champagne we'd had. It was my fault. Pushing it on, I'm sorry. You know, he's only 14, for God's sake. Do you remember what woke you? Yeah, um, him touching me. Internally, I mean, we, we, we talked about all this when we called, you know. It's hard, I know. And I'm so sorry, but we need you to go over it with us too. And what then? I'll take a swab where he touched you, as well as a urine sample. And then, then can I get a shower? We'll take you to be examined by a forensic medical examiner first. Our oh, swabs. I'm afraid so. Are these the clothes that you were wearing during the assault? We'll need to take them when you're examined. So I'll keep them on for now. If you can. Then can I take her home? There'll be an interview. Oh, an an another one? This one will be recorded and in more detail. We'll need to get specific. I'm sorry, she's already gone over this twice now. So... Sailor, look, it's all right. I want to get it right, OK? Whatever you need, you just tell me, yeah? Thanks for lending me these. It's all right. Are you holding up now, eh? Oh, glad I'm done being prodded and poked. They were good, weren't they? You know, getting me through fast and everything. Yeah, they was. So, um. I think it might be time that you call David now. Well, there's no way you can do, is there? I mean, he's had enough on his plate today. Amber's been poorly in the car and... You know, he sent me a text earlier, but I missed it when I was, you know, out of it and that, so... Um... I don't know how you're doing this. Hey, Staying so strong. Am I? Yes. <laughs> All them interviews. Examination. I wanted every last horrible little detail. But you kept it together, didn't you? You stayed calm. You know, when I was working at the club, so many of the girls got into just really bad situations. They'd be flaming sleazes thinking that they had the right. But you know what? Half the time, they wouldn't even report it. Well, they were too afraid, I guess. Yeah. Not you, though, eh? 
Not my big sis. Do you know how relieved the police were that you could keep it together like that? So many girls can't, you know. Hello. Ah, thought you might be here. I am so sorry I'm late. Flipping car broke down a mile out from the hospital. It's just a leaky radiator, so it'll be right as rain for tomorrow. Oh, time for a brew. It's all right, I got your message. <sighs> Do you know what? You are the bestest, most understanding wife ever. <laughs> so, birthday celebrations moved here, did they? No. Only no. I, uh, I got home and there was champers and stuff all out. You run out. Come here, red little lustache. <laughs> Is Amber all right, then? Yeah, she's fine. Just wanted to spend all afternoon cuddled up in her daddy's arms. Who could blame her? What are you doing in your gym jams, you lightweight? David. What? Um, we're only just back ourselves, but don't worry, it's all sorted down now. What sort? Lachlan. <sighs> that kid is a flipping liability. You have got to stop making excuses for him, I'm telling you. Right, that's it, he's not working for us anymore. All right. Oh, huh. right, good. So, what's he done now? He was, uh, he was inappropriate with his touching. He touched you, how? He assaulted me, sexually. Why'd you do it, hmm? We know about Alicia. Luckily, mate, no one's accusing you of anything. We, we just want to know where your head's at. And why are you taking these? Are these photos of Alicia. What about them? Well, they're intrusive and odd. Does she know you were taking them? No, that would have ruined it. Ruined it how? The surprise. Jacob asked me to do a photo book for her birthday. You know, but all of his photos, they were blurred, useless. So you, you took your own? Yeah. She and David have been really nice to me, and Jacob's a mate. You know, I wanted to help. Waste of time. Why? What do you mean? And Jacob hated it. And I tossed it. And now you think I'm some sort of seedy weirdo. No, I know. I don't. I don't. Then why are you going through my stuff again? Why are you looking at those photos like I'm some sort of sleazy freak or something? I'm so sorry, Lucky. I, th I think I got the wrong end of the stick. You always do. Is that why you made us move here? Because you thought I'd hurt that girl. No, I know you didn't. You thought it, though. And then you thought I was hurting Belle, and worse. And now Alicia. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have... Why, for once, can you not just trust me? Like you promised. Like mums are supposed to do. You OK? Yeah. No, of course you're not OK. What a stupid question. I'm gonna rip into pieces. Hey, 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 hey. No, all right, so the police are on it. You attacking him is not gonna help your wife, right? What she needs now is you to just take her own, right? Just be with her. Hey, look, you don't need to be doing all that now, do you? No, it's all right, it's no bother. So sorry. You didn't do it, David. Yeah, but <clears throat> I knew how weird he was, and I knew how much he liked you. I didn't send him back in. Well, we all thought he was harmless. Didn't yeah, but I wasn't there for you, was I? I didn't stop him. It's done now. Um, what about pizza? What? You know, like for tea and that. I. No, no, Alicia, no, I'm not hungry. Me neither, really. Oh, I've got to pick Jacob up. No, um, you don't. He's um, with his dad's now till Monday. Yeah, I forgot. I, uh, I'll have to tell him as well now, won't I? No, not, not if you're not ready. Yeah, no, um, yeah, I don't want to spoil his weekend. <sighs> Alicia, you... 
It's going to be all right to go home. No, not yet. What are you doing? Well, the dishes aren't going to wash themselves, are they? So... Well, you should talk to me. About what? Because Layla's filled you in already and I've gone over it that many times. We just need to forget about it now, right? Just keep going as we were.